welcome to the Cookie Couture, where flavor and design collide. Today I'm going to share with you how you can decorate very pretty Alice in Wonderland cookies. And also I'm going to share with you the whole process, starting from designing to baking, decorating, packaging, and everything that you need to come with a great cookie idea. And, um, and I hope that you like it and let's get started. how you can design the cookies and as you may know there are a lot of cookies out there a lot of cookies on Pinterest Instagram everywhere but the thing is that you need to be different and you need to be unique on your creations to stand out in that big crowd okay so when I started doing these cookies is maybe like 10 years ago um, I love the movie Alice in Wonderland. I really, really love it, and I love all the colors, particularly in the cartoon one. I love, I love also the the light one, but I really love the the signs and the colors that they use in the cartoon movie. So I hope that you really like it, and that you, if you have an idea, try always to be different and try to think out of the box to make something unique. Okay. Okay. So first, let's do the design. This part is super important because it's gonna help you to keep you organized because you're gonna see what are the cookie colors that you're going to need, what are the colors that you're going to need, and also what are the consistencies of icings that you need to make to decorate these cookies. I don't have any Alice in Wonderland cookie cutters so I have to look into my cookie cutter collection to see which ones were um, suit to that theme so as you can see all the cookie cutters are different and there's nothing to do with Alice in Wonderland but as you may see the process you're gonna see how they are coming to life okay And now I'm going to share with you also how important it is to use the best ingredients in all your recipes. Your cookies are going to be more delicious and the um, texture is going to be also super nice. Okay, so this is what I did to bake those delicious cookies. Please click the link above to see one of my favorite recipes.
Okay, and now that the cookies are out of the oven, I need to cool them down and meanwhile I will prepare my royal icing that if you click the link above, there's the tutorial and the recipe for the royal icing, okay? For this cookie, um, you need to prepare a lot of colors because as you can see, Alice in Wonderland, well, not as you can see, but as you remember, Alice in Wonderland is all about colors and designs, so you need to prepare a lot of royal icing colors, okay? So this is a fun part. I like to start decorating the cookies that are going to be white, and from that icing, I'm going to start adding the different colors that I'm going to need.
operating. We need to drive them and then we're going to do the next step that are the final touches. Okay, and now that the cookies are ready, the packaging is super, super important. As you can see, some of the figures are very fragile, and if you're going to ship them, you need to be very, very careful that the packaging is up to the great standard. So, I'm going to show you also a link above on how you can ship your cookies so you avoid breakage during the transit. of your cookies is as important as I have told you before uh, the flavor and the design so I'm going to put them in a very cute tin box so they are fresh when they arrive to the people that you are going to send them And that's it guys, I really hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. I really really love these cookies, are my, well every time I say this is my favorite cookie, I don't think so that I um, have just one favorite cookie, but this was maybe the best experience that I have had with one cookie design that I have made because I was able to ship maybe, I don't know, maybe like 300 of these cookies like in those years. Um, and I am so happy that um, the people really, really love them and that um, I hope that I make a good memory for them and uh, that my cookies were part of their lives, okay? And thank you so much for coming today. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And thank you so much for all your lovely comments. They are so, so nice and I really, really appreciate that you take your time and writing those comments that I know for so many people it, mm, are very busy and even though you have the time and and um, I can feel the love in your letters so I really really appreciate and see you next time guys oh and don't forget to follow me on my Instagram my Pinterest and my Twitter okay see you next time bye bye